Hello, welcome to another next quick voice tip for the day. Uh, today I've really felt the need for my tongue to be a little looser and more responsive than it uh, than it could be. <laughs> um, so I thought I'd introduce you to a little tongue exercise that I find really useful for increasing release of the tongue. Uh, that bunching that sometimes happen at the back of the tongue when we get a bit of tongue root tension and also clarity of the tongue tip and response of the tongue tip which is necessary for lots of the different consonants that we make. So this is a tongue one. Now depending where you are you might want to uh, find a little bit of privacy because this one involves sticking your tongue out. So here we go. Find yourself in a nice comfortable position seated or standing and what you're going to do is the tongue's going to come out of the mouth, it's going to point up, down, left, right, and then it's going to come back in the mouth and tap just in here on the little gummy bit that the teeth go into. That's the alveolar ridge or the gum ridge. So you're going to go up, down, left, right, come back in and then tap in there. And it looks a bit like this. Now, a couple of things to notice. Number one is my tongue's quite long and sausagey, for want of a better word. So I'm not going. I'm keeping it nice and uh, clean. The tongue's coming out. Imagine someone just gently pulling the end of your tongue so it comes into a bit more of a sausagey shape rather than a flat shape. And then we're really working on the tip going up, the tip going down, the tip going left, and the tip going right. So it's nice and accurate. A couple of things just to notice is you might feel a bit of excess kind of um, jaw tension kicking in as the jaw tries to stabilize what's going on. If that's the case, just don't put it out quite as far. Because what we don't want is to put tension into our jaw while we're trying to release tension from the tongue. That doesn't make any sense. Another nice thing you can do with this one is to do it in the inside of the mouth. So the same idea, tip up, tip down, tip left, tip right, and then tap on the alveolar ridge. It's another nice way of doing it a little bit more discreetly. So if you're in an audition situation and you don't want anybody to notice that you're warming up, you can do that one quite easily with your mouth closed. I was doing it right then. <laughs> so it's a really nice one that can be adapted to the situation. So just a reminder, tongue's coming out as if someone is just pulling on the end of it. So it goes nice and sausagey, pointing the tip up, down, left, right, bringing it back in, tapping it behind the teeth, just on the alveolar ridge. You can do it inside the mouth as well. And if you feel any excess jaw tension coming in, just don't go out quite as far. And just watch out for this. We don't want any of that as well. Okay, there we go. That's your next quick voice fit. Next quick voice tip for today. The irony of not being able to pronounce that at the end of an articulation release exercise. It's not lost on me. <laughs> I hope you've enjoyed that. Check out the YouTube channel for all the other next quick voice tips. And if you want any particular tips about any particular sort of voice, uh, drop me a little message and let me know and I'll see what I can do. See you again soon. Get those tongues waggling. <laughs>